Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 3 of The Mandalorian. I am so excited. After last week, I cannot fucking wait to see what happens this week. Um, last week we had the reveal of the Mythosaur. Um, I don't know if we're going to explore that this episode or if they're going to wait till later in the season. I have no idea, but um, yeah, that was pretty fucking crazy. Um... Bo's gonna say to Din, hey, I saw the Mythosaur, and he's gonna be like, you're talking shit. Um, so yeah, let's, I, I'm, I'm just excited. I, I'm excited to see where we go. This episode seems to be a bit longer than last week's as well, so that's also good. So let's get into the episode. Oh, he's so fucking cool, man. He's so cool. I wonder if Grogu could sense him. That'd be interesting. Din, wake up. We've got a Mythosaur in our hands. <laughs> Din! Din! Oh, Grogu's over him. No, Pippi. The first thing he sees when he opens his eyes. Ah. You see anything down there? I saw the chasm passing me as I fell. I didn't realize it was so deep. Did you see anything alive? Alive? Like what? Ah. Nothing. Are you, she's not gonna yeah, tell yeah. him? What is your reasoning behind not telling him? That's suspicious. That's weird. Why wouldn't she tell him? I mean, I guess that, you know, nobody's gonna believe her. This is the way. This is the way. Oh! We took a hit. Something's coming up on us fast. It looks like a squadron of high interceptors. Oh, hello! How close are we to Kalevala? Where'd they come from? I've scuffed off a lot of Imperial warlords. Get ready, we're coming in hot. I won't be able to slow down for the drop. Fuck. Stay safe, Grogu. Oh, this is gonna be so cool. Oh, that's intimidating as fuck. Oh, look at him go! This is epic. Let's go, Din! Oh! Oh! Yeah, boy! That was sick! <laughs> oh! Made it to the N1. Heading to you. Nice one! Let's go! Thanks for the backup. Two more to go. Oh, this is epic! Try spinning. That's a good trick. One down, Ooh, one more to go. That was Honest. pretty. Ooh, that was such a cool maneuver. Oh. Whoa. Goddamn. Boom, ma'am. Oh, they're so epic together. What Not the fuck? What the fuck? You take any damage? No. No, what the f the tie bombers? That was a distraction. What the fuck? No. You get him, boo. You get him. Nice. Oh god, oh. <gasps> oh we've got company. That's a lot of company. Bo, listen to me. What the hell? <laughs> that was wild! And that was just the opening! Coruscant? Whoa! It's so pretty! Why are we applauding? Yes, well done. Woo! Sadly, my 
my research was twisted into something cruel and inhumane at the behest of a desperate individual intent on using cloning technology to secure more power for himself. Kitty? But despite She's the back? Work of my past, what? I now hope to help. Holy shit, Kitty's back. Dude, that's so I cool. Young, I'm so happy. I lost my mother. The person who I admired most. I don't hit me in the feels like this, dude. Simple organ cloning been available on my home world. Her death would have been easily preventable. Thanks to the groundbreaking work of the Kaminoans, we know that cloning can duplicate an individual from a single genetic strand. Kamino and name drop. Ooh. My work explored was the Dude, I'm still I can't believe they brought Kitty back. Like, I wonder if she's gonna get a name and a story now, because she was just an unnamed uh Imperial, I'm pretty sure. I going to end this and I thought she died and I was really scared. Congratulations on making it into the program. I was like, I hope Thank she's you. alive. You better not kill the hot Imperial officer. She better stay alive. I think you will find it a very lovely city. You what a nice droid. The Sky Dome Botanical Gardens. M40 G68. Doctor. Ah. Uh. All right. I didn't expect to see anyone from Moff Gideon's ship here. Gideon. Oh, exposed. I didn't know you worked for him. Thanks to the rehabilitation program, I can contribute to the New Republic. Long live the New Republic. I felt like I had to drink Thanks with them. The I'd be happy to show you around when you do. Thank you. Besties? Uniform did fit better. I... Maybe those uh, yellow... Travel biscuits for Federation guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that brings back memories. Oh, bless him. Why am I starting to like him? <laughs> get those on the core walls. Uh, no. It's not precisely located at our... It's gonna be her? I keep calling her Kitty because she still doesn't have an in-show name. Uh-oh. Please don't be something bad. Does someone knock and run? Are they really playing knock and run? Oh, it's a box. Is it a welcome box with yellow biscuits in it? Oh! Damn, someone's got a bit of a crush to be leaving biscuits outside his door. Good morning, L52. Happy Bindu Day. Another set. Bindu Day? Good morning. Oh, I'm loving this. Wow. Lizard. A trillion. That's a cool droid. Whoa. Nice. Dun, 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 dun. Are we allowed to? The music in the background is sick. Is that a chiss in the background? I see someone blue. Was that a chiss? This is so cute. I love this. Have you experienced any feelings of anger or resentment towards the New Republic government or its representatives? No. Having a therapist as a droid ask a question. is great. Proceed. According to your file, your previous research involved cloning and genetic engineering. That class of research is expressly prohibited by the Chorus and Accords, Section 13, Subparagraph 7. Thank you for continuing to be an important... Why do I feel like he's still going to do it secretly? Have a nice day. He has it looming over him. He wants to research it so badly. Have you experienced any feelings of anger or resentment? No. Thank you for continuing... Liar. Our objective is to help the Republic, right? Correct. Thank you for continuing to be an important... He's like, uh, loophole. Like, I'm going to break the rules, but it's for the Republic, so that's okay. <laughs> the droid confirmed it for me. It's the right thing to do. Is it, though? The motherfuckers are out there trying to clone the fucking Zillow Beast. Cloning fucking Palpatine, of all people. Like, I don't... I don't... I... <sighs> 
follow my lead. Dude, I love her outfit. You're better at this than I am. You're being so suspicious, dude. It's so easy to just not be suspicious. Fair enough strategy. Great security they've got going on here. Nice to know. You slip in, grab what you need, and we're back at MSD housing before you know it. Have you done this before? Where do you think I got the biscuits? <laughs> Damn, she went to a lot of effort to get some biscuits. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's not suspicious at all. Yeah, exactly. Very suspicious. Oh. Hello, everybody. Tongs days. Am I right? <laughs> he tried. Uh, guys? She's crazy. You jump from that, you're dead. Trust me. Okay, at least it's slowing down a bit. Well, maybe not. Good God. Well, that was terrifying. But I bet he enjoyed it. Yep, there's the laugh. <laughs> Oh, baby. That's a big ship. Oh, my God. I've never done anything like this before. Eliah Kane. Eliah. A name, finally. Yes, Eliah. Dr. Penn Pershing. What was that? Keep packing. I'll keep watch just in case. Okay, now do I feel like she's betting him? I wonder what or who was on the ship. And Mr. Scientist, L-52, raise your hands. You were under arrest. Well done, lads. <laughs> you really fucked it up this time. She did bit him. <gasps> so now they know what Wait. he needed Wait. for these like cloning Wait. things. Uh, Are they? <laughs> what? It's a non-invasive experimental treatment recently approved for rehabilitation. No, it's a mind flare. It's a similar device. I'll be here when you wake up. You don't understand. She brought me there. It was a trap. Please. I just yeah, saying it's out. a trap to him. <laughs> yep. She sent me up. Please. Is she trying to just get in the good books of the New Republic? I really wanted them to be besties. Is she going to wipe his whole memory? Why is she like this? She's gonna fry his fucking brain. Damn, empire through and through. I have been to the mines of Mandalore. Impossible. The mines were collapsed. I've got the proof. The planet is cursed. I was witness. And who are you, Night Owl? I am bo of Clan Kreese. Your house has fallen from the way. You were both apostates. Damn, if I, was, if I was her, I'd feel so uneasy. But then she has bo -Katan. She could take all... I feel like she could take them all down. <laughs> it 
He speaks the truth. You are redeemed. This is the way. This is the way. Though Katon Kreese, you too are redeemed. Then you may join our covert and live as your ancestors once did. He's not gonna like that. Anytime you wish. You are one of us. I like that Welcome she's accepting. Bo-Katan of Clan Kreese. Oh, I love this hearing Clan Kreese. This is the way. Aw, this is nice, actually. This is really nice. He's not happy. Oh, what she knows and what they don't know. Oh. God damn. Oh. Well, that was a very interesting episode of Mandalorian. It is not what I expected at all. Um, the start of it was fucking insane. Like with the with Bo and Din working together, fighting off the TIE fighters. That was that was epic. Um, that was really, really cool. I am sad for Bo that her home was destroyed. That was quite sad to see, you know, after witnessing what happened to Mandalore and then having to see this happen, she just can't catch a break. But also, why is she hiding the Mythosaur from Din? I get why she'd hide them from the rest of the, you know, the rest of the Creed, the rest of the Mandalorians. That's fine. She doesn't know them. She doesn't trust them. But why specifically is she hiding them from, hiding it from Din? I hope it's not some, like, tactical thing where she's going to try and do it herself and try and claim Mandalore sneakily in like a shady kind of way um i don't know i don't know how to i don't know how to take it at this point i don't know what to expect or what to think um it's it was nice to see the you know the the, the clan accepting her but it is a bit of a cult and i think that her and din should definitely leave asap um i don't think she's very accepting of the whole don't take your helmet off thing like she's like what the fuck is this shit um but yeah we we're gonna work with it for now um this episode did feel very sort of andor-esque in a way um and i cannot complain at all i thought it was a very good episode we got katie o'brien back and i am so happy so if anyone doesn't remember her she was the imperial that we saw in the mandalorian season two and i fell in love with her as did a lot of people and then she got shot and I was like so worried that she died. And I was saying, no, they're going to bring her back. They have to bring her back. There's no way. They're like, they, they have to. I didn't actually believe that they would. And they motherfucking did. They fucking brought her back. And I'm so happy. And now she has a name, uh, Elia. If that is her real name, we don't know for sure. Is she working for someone else? Is she a spy? Is she working for Moff Gideon still? Um, Like, I don't know what her objective is with turning his like the 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 machine up that high um what way is she wanting to brainwash him i have no idea but i feel like it could be a moth gideon thing like maybe she's still working for gideon and she's in there secretly i had really high hopes for her i i did have high hopes but also i kind of like the idea like i feel like it's been done enough where we see someone from the empire you know leaving and joining like the rebels or the new republic all that kind of stuff like they they go good but there's never enough of people going bad so i feel like having her look like she's going good but she's actually staying bad i quite like that i do quite like that concept um so i am i'm okay with it i'm okay but the per doctor man like he just wants to do what's good like yeah he's been a bit of a mm, you know he's not being the best but like <sighs> He was seeing colors and pretty things and he was healing and then she just had to ruin it and hurt him. So I don't know where we're going with this. I don't know what's happening, but it was a chaotic episode. Um, and yeah, I, I definitely enjoyed seeing the like all the Imperial stuff and all like the Starfighters and stuff like that was really cool. Um, like the Star Destroyer and stuff that was like really, really cool to see that and like see the inside of it or like all not being used and stuff. That was nice. I would like to go through uh, like a wreck shipyard kind of thing like that it was also very fallen order-esque as well with that kind of thing um but yeah i enjoyed this um episode and i hope you guys did too let me know what you think in the comments and make sure you subscribe for more mandalorian and bad batch content which will be the next video coming straight after this um unless i upload that one first who knows i have no idea um but thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in the next video so peace and may the force be with you